Hello, I'm Ashley and these are the week's top headlines from Pink 60. The Human Dignity Trust has launched a global campaign to decriminalise homosexuality in the 80 countries where it is outlawed. A court case scheduled for December 5th has been brought by the gay Belizean activist Kayla Barosko. The Russian city of St. Petersburg has passed a law which finds anyone who discusses or displays gay lifestyle in front of minors. The law equates homosexuality with paedophilia and has been described as medieval. The United Nations made its first ever criticism of Iran's treatment of queer people in a recent statement. UNHCR has called for a repeal of all anti-gay legislation in the country which regularly executes gay people. Warnings associated with HIV drug Raltegravir have been updated on US packaging to warn over Stevens Johnson syndrome, a potentially life-threatening skin reaction. Patients are advised to contact their doctor immediately if they develop a rash. And finally, the former head of Uganda's female rugby team has been granted asylum in Germany. Lillian Okumet said she had been raped, beaten and discriminated against in her home country because of her sexuality. That's all from us today. Join us again tomorrow.